D18 skills. Hey, it's D18 skills here. Today I'm going to show you how to make a transparent background for your image. Uh, the image has to have like a white background or a easy to take out color like a solid. So first, uh, get GIMP. Uh, the link will be in the description. It's a really good soft, I mean a picture editing software. So, okay, get a picture now. I'm going to do duct, duct tape. Uh, this picture looks good. I'll save it. Save it to my desktop as a transparent. Okay. I'll exit out and get that picture and open up GIMP. Uh, and just drag that picture down into GIMP and it'll open it up. Okay, now what you're going to want to do is go to layer up here. Layer, transparency, and add alpha channel. Okay, add it in alpha channel and go up here to the fuzzy select tool. This little wand and click on the white and delete. And then click on the white and delete. And as you can see, uh, there's these little bricks represent transparency. Uh, you might see these little fuzzy things right there, but uh, you can erase those by zooming in, zooming in, and uh, getting the eraser tool and erasing it yourself. Okay, I'm fine with this though. So I'm going to save it as, you have to save it as, and save it as a PNG. Oops. PNG or a GIF file. I'm going to save it as a PNG and save it. Now, to prove that it has transparency, I am going to make a pure black background. As you can see, I made a new one, a pure black background. And then open up that file I just saved right here and edit it so I can copy it and then paste it on and you'll see that it's transparent so uh, here's a tip, uh, quick trick right here if you click right here and put control A it will select the whole picture and th this, these are called hotkeys okay so control A is to select all Control C is to copy it to your clipboard, and Control V is to paste. So there's a quick tip right there. Okay, as you can see, it's transparent, and I can move it around, or I I could. Okay, I can move it around, and I'll add this layer right here so I can move it. And then if I go back to this background layer, and delete uh, the part right there. As you can see, it deletes it, and I can cross through it, whatever. So that's how you get a transparent background for a picture. Uh, subscribe, rate, and comment. D18 skills.